Ring Contest is a steel cage match and is for the WWE United States Championship. It is main event time from the PPG Paints Arena, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. The steel cage set to be lowered and the red, white, blue and gold is on the line. We showed you the highlights of how we got here earlier tonight, but it really began last month in London after Cody Rhodes had defended his United States Championship over the Bruiserweight Butch, AJ Styles, attacking Cody Rhodes from behind, throwing down the gauntlet that he was coming for Cody's championship. Cody's been seeking retribution ever since, and you saw last week on SmackDown, Cody trying to eliminate the X-Factors of Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows having the steel cage lying in wait. Unfortunately for Cody, he turned his back just at the last second. AJ Styles took advantage and used the cage against the American Nightmare. How that played into Cody's condition this past Sunday at Survivor Series really is unknown, but of course we saw at Survivor Series inside Madison Square Garden, AJ Styles get the best of the American Nightmare and leave as the United States Champion. Cody now not only seeking retribution from that sneak attack last month in London, England, but seeking back the gold he originally won at SummerSlam in August, looking to become a two-time United States Champion here tonight in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Cody Rhodes certainly looks laser focused on the task at hand. And we talked about this Sunday night, and the story remains the same tonight on SmackDown. Cody's gotta make sure his anger and frustration do not get the best of him, allowing him to see red and unfortunately, possibly cost his own self a mistake in allowing AJ Styles to capitalize. All remains to be seen. Survivor Series is in the past. All Cody can do is look towards the now with the United States Championship that is now around the waist of the phenomenal AJ Styles. Styles made his mission very clear. Anybody who did not benefit his US Championship desires could step aside or get stepped on. Outside of Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows, I don't think AJ Styles has any friends left in the SmackDown locker room. And quite frankly, I don't think the phenomenal one cares now that he's got the gold around his waist. AJ Styles snuck attack Cody Rhodes from behind, got what he wanted at Survivor Series, and clearly all worked out for the man in the black and the red. But now he's gotta face his demons once more. Cody Rhodes out for retribution, and now seeking so much more. The championship around the waist of AJ Styles. Is Cody about to become a two-time United States champion? And will it be a short-lived reign for the Phenomenal One, or does Styles have the number of Cody Rhodes? That is certainly a point that many have brought up, that Styles has been in the head of the American Nightmare over the last month and played him like a fiddle at Survivor Series. At the end of the night, it all comes down to this, the Steel Cage and the United States Championship. Introducing the challenger from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes! And his opponent from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, he is the WWE United States Champion, the phenomenal AJ Styles. Well, just two weeks before we get to our final live premiere event of 2023, Friday Night SmackDown days removed from Survivor Series is headlined by a big time championship bout, the United States Championship on the line as the former champion Cody Rhodes looks to win back the goals days removed from it escaping his grasp against the phenomenal AJ Styles. Pinfall submission or escaping the cage, the only way to win this matchup. Who's gonna be the last man standing and leave Pittsburgh with the red, white, blue, and gold? 
The bell has sounded. We are underway. Cody Rhodes getting his wish. AJ locked inside a cage. And hopefully this week turns out a little bit better for the American Nightmare. Cody may have just been in a very angered and frustrated state seven nights ago and then followed suit at Survivor Series. Hopefully if Cody's got his head on straight, he'll be able to focus and take down AJ Styles and become a two-time champ. All remains to be seen. They don't call AJ the phenomenal one for nothing. It's not just from bell to bell. It's the mind games as well. AJ Styles has been around the mountain before. He's been to the top. He's fought the best and he has beaten the best. And he's looking to go back to back victories against the American Nightmare. Cody Rhodes, however, with different plans in mind. This is what Cody wanted seven nights ago. Just tried to get even with AJ Styles and eliminate the X Factors of Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows, knowing they would be looming within moments. Of course, Anderson and Gallows not even out here tonight as the steel cage surrounds the ring, and there is nothing they can do. It is down to AJ Styles to secure victory inside this cage. Cody all over the champion in the early going, going for a couple of quick victories. Maybe not to win the matchup just yet, but just to try to get in the psyche of Styles, realizing that Cody is at his best tonight, or at least he wants him to believe so. And try to get AJ Styles maybe a little shook, maybe a little worried. The American Nightmare is way more focused than he was in Madison Square Garden at Survivor Series. Of course, the replay for the fall. Classic Survivor Series available now. Dare I say, one of the best, if not the best, live premiere events of 2023. It was an historic night this past Sunday. The replay available right now, just two weeks out from Armageddon, your final live premiere event of the year. Styles trying to tap out Cody Rhodes. Remember, pinfall, submission, or escaping the cage. First man to have both feet touching the floor would be the victor, whether you climb over the top or go through the door. See the referee waiting right there, ready to open that cage door if either one of these competitors calls for it. I got a feeling Cody Rhodes may not be going for the escape tonight. I think he wants the emphatic victory by pinfall or submission over AJ Styles. On the other hand, don't think AJ Styles would mind escaping the cage and putting Cody Rhodes behind him. More remains to be seen as Cody sends AJ into the corner and Cody throwing a couple of haymakers. Just trying to wear down the phenomenal one. You know, one thing we saw in that matchup at Survivor Series, a little bit of the same story. Cody coming out hot, and Cody did control a good chunk of the matchup. Not the majority of it, but I'd say it wasn't a 50-50 split when it came to the offense on Sunday. I would say Cody definitely more of a 70-30, 60-40, something along those lines. And it was really just that last couple of blows that had Cody Rhodes shook long enough and allowed AJ Styles to get the Styles Clash and earn the victory. And maybe about to do the same there off the Exploder into the corner, but Cody Rhodes still with life left in him. AJ Styles not looking to see the United States Championship that he just won at Survivor Series disappear around his waist. Just a few days removed as Styles now springboard, big time crossbody. Styles played his cards right over the last month and change. Played the chess match that Cody Rhodes was not prepared for. And it worked out on Sunday. Looks like it may work out again tonight, but Cody Rhodes with another kick out. Oh, wait a minute, Cody's down, and AJ Styles says, fine, I don't have to pin you. I can just climb over and retain my title. AJ looking to get the hell out of Dodge with the American Nightmare with other plans. And a power bomb by Cody after Styles was trying to scale the walls of the cage. Now Cody, disaster kick on Styles. Into another cover to win the United States title, not just yet. AJ Styles kick it out again, but you know he's got to be worse for wear after that power bomb just a few moments ago by the American Nightmare. Cody, looked like he was trying to send AJ into the cage that time. AJ caught himself in his tracks, and Cody Rhodes forcefully this time sends AJ Styles into the steel. Cody Rhodes has not forgotten about the ambush from behind. A sneak attack moments after Cody had already competed last month in the O2 in London. 
He has been replaying that moment night after night in his mind, waiting to get his hands on AJ Styles and to get the victory over the phenomenal one. You know it is gonna be a great night for Cody Rhodes, a feel-good moment if he can kill two birds with one stone, not only win back his United States Championship, but seek that redemption over Styles as he hits the vertebra breaker and maybe just about to do so. And Styles kicks out again, another close call. No waste in motion by Cody Rose tonight. Oh, wait a minute, Cody may be looking to just escape the cage, win back the title that way. Yeah. Or maybe not, different plans by Cody. And another kick out there by Styles, but Cody using the cage to scale the wall and use it to his advantage, dropping an elbow on the heart of Styles. Big time close call. Wait a minute, Styles. Oh, wait, he might have Cody rocked and catches him with a Styles clash. A repeat of Sunday Night in the Garden. And this time, Cody Rhodes kicks out. Cody Rhodes survives. AJ trying to repeat history. A quick shot to Cody Rhodes and the Styles clash. And oh, wait a minute. I think AJ's calling for the door. He wants to get the hell out of Dodge, but Cody Rhodes is on his tail. High stakes, high reward in your SmackDown main event tonight in Pittsburgh. The steel cage surrounds the ring. Who is going to use it to their fullest advantage and leave with the U.S. title? Another kick out by the American Nightmare. A lot of near falls in this matchup. Both these men realizing that they are in a dangerous situation tonight. Hell bent on destroying one another with championships on the line and a cage surrounding the ring. Almost does not get any more luminous. And the ante almost doesn't get any more up than this. Off the crossbody, Styles once again calling for the door. Couple of locks on that thing. It's not as in and out as it may seem as Cody Rhodes once again stopping AJ Styles dead in his tracks. Cody says you want to fight. You're going to have to finish the job once and for all. Not looking to allow AJ Styles to climb over the cage and escape with the United States Championship in that oh-so-ugly fashion. Cody, in his mind, believes AJ Styles won the battle on Sunday, but he has not won the war just yet. Tonight is where they get the last laugh. Reversal for reversal that time. Now Cody muscling up. The phenomenal one, marching him around the ring, just sending a message to Styles that the American Nightmare is game tonight. A big time shoulder breaker. Take out the arm, he may take out the phenomenal forearm. But Styles may just have enough room to hit between the ropes and the cage. Cody again dropping him on the shoulder. American Nightmare just trying to pick apart the leader of the OC is I'm sure Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson look on from the locker room knowing that it is all up to AJ Styles tonight. Go big or go home. Win or die trying inside of that ring. Wait a minute, what's Cody got in mind? Once again, scaling the ropes. I don't know if he was going for the escape that time or if he was just going for another aerial maneuver. And wait a minute, looks like that was gonna be the result. However, AJ Styles had it scouted and a big time backdrop. Cody Rhodes wants the decisive victory, wants the one, two, three, but realizes he can get some extra elevation in trying to aid his victory tonight. It looks like Styles going to the corner. Trying to escape the American nightmare. Wait a minute here. AJ climbing the cage. Cody Rhodes is also climbing the cage. What do we got here? It may be a race to the finish line between AJ Styles and Cody Rhodes. Styles hustle it up. Cody trying to meet him there. Styles is on his way out. Oh, Cody Rhodes stopping him. Oh, this is a dangerous position by champion and challenger in a precarious spot on the top of the steel cage. Oh no, Cody Rhodes taking the fall off the top, down to the floor. 
And Cody trying to let adrenaline flow through his soul. Injured, off balance, is the American Nightmare trying to catch up to Styles. Oh, Cody just doesn't have the wherewithal, doesn't have the balance, trying to scale, trying to get AJ Styles in time, but Styles escapes the cage. Cody Rhodes tried his darndest in that last moment, but got shucked off the top, down to the ground, inside the squared circle, tried to hustle up, tried to put the pain behind him, but too dazed, too in pain, and too off balance, and unfortunately not able to catch up to the phenomenal AJ Styles. And Styles goes two for two, this time escaping the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes to retain the United States Championship. Here is your winner, and still, WWE United States Champion, the phenomenal AJ Styles. Another disappointing loss for Cody Rhodes, but that flip, that switch has been flipped in AJ Styles, and the phenomenal one just may be better than ever before. The United States Championship rest on the shoulders of Styles. You gotta wonder what is next and who is next to step up to the new man who holds the red, white, blue, and gold. We'll see you next week on Friday Night Smackdown. On when I chase like that, yeah, I play so strong with a knife in the back. I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat. Gonna see me rise if you hate on that. I don't play both sides, don't need no cap. I'm a rock.